and then you can compare the results online here and you say this score is better than 99% of all results okay this this is office laptop down here at the bottom gaming laptop above that gaming PC above that at 9,000 high-end gaming PC 11,085 this score is somewhere in between the high-end gaming PC and the premium but look at this premium scores that are they're reaching like 3k more this is a, a AMD build Ryzen 9 with the RTX 2080 Ti two of them bad boys huh they got two of them bad boys in there but yeah, I'm happy with the new system. The R11 from Dell is a beast of a machine. And I, I think it's slick that you can, you know, overclock it and, and fiddle with it a little bit. But is it worth it at the end of the day? I don't know. Maybe you're like super competitive and you want those five frames in Call of Duty. That way you can see his little nose poke out from around the corner and laser beam this kid. But... Let's, let's drag it back down here. I5. Test it. 78, 79, 78, 79. Holding that 5 gigahertz. it down 1.34 volts that's at 82 degrees save that one alright so we did that CPU, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna just ramp it up. 90. 75. Let's test it here. We're gonna ramp it up a little bit. We're gonna run the 3D mark and see what kind of scores we get. And uh, I've got the results on my phone from the test when it was just running in regular mode like when I got it it said it wasn't overclocked like the CPU got I'm gonna save these okay overclock 2.1 we're on overclock 2 All right, so we're sitting at 4.98. We like teetering right there. Go ahead and, and boot it up and see how it runs. Oh, the, the, the frames is down. Oh, well, I ain't gonna sweat it. It's still, it's still pretty high at 27.94. Supposed to be 29.94. I'm gonna let that I'm gonna let that fly.
I think read my first impressions is this is doing better than the last time I ran the test without the overclocking. And last time the 3080s outscored 98% of the the testers on Port Royal. I think Yeah, I don't know how much better it's going to be in the score wise, but oh, this was the tough one right here. Okay, so last time, yes, we got 15,307 overall score. And our graphic score was 16,592 last time, compared to 17,437. And our CPU score was 10,641 last time. This time it's eleven thousand and eighty seven with the max FPS for the CPU being thirty five point seven five last time and beat it out by thirty seven point two five. So it gets you a few more frames. Uh the graphics test one was a hundred and ten FPS point 7, 7 FPS last time and this one was 115.76 so that's like 5 frames per second more then the graphics test number 2 the first go around it was 93.18 and this time it's 98.39 quick maths it's like 5 points better each, each go around with the overclocking 